Hey guys, it's Lindsay with Mama Schmooze Reviews and welcome to my dining room. I am here with my Dollar Tree mug full of water I need to be drinking. My kids are sick so I'm trying to drink some water here. I just went to the Dollar Tree tonight, snuck over there and I am back here. They just went to bed and I'm going to share with you guys what I got for them. I have a three-year-old son and a five-year-old daughter and this is a video that I am doing with a bunch of ladies. Rachel from Day to Day Joys put it together and you are going to see a playlist down below and you will see like tons of ideas for stocking stuffers. If you want to see some really budget friendly stocking stuffers for under $12 for each stocking um, that are at the Dollar Tree, stay tuned. They are really, really cool educational toys a sweet treat and multi-purpose things that can be used throughout the year. So if you want to know what I got, stay tuned. First I'm going to share with you guys what I got my daughter that just turned five. So this is definitely a little bit girly, but I got some of the similar things for my son because they're so close in age. So first I got a chocolate like M&M candy cane for them, but they're not called chocolate M&Ms. They're called chocolate lentils. Really? That's so funny. <laughs> so these are just so cute to put on the outside of the stockings and the kids freak out. So chocolate is amazing. They love it. I love it. Hopefully I won't steal it before they get it. Um, that's usually my problem. I eat it before they get it. But So that's for my daughter. And then I got these really cool safety goggles. They're mainly for my son, but I know if he has them, she's going to want them. But we are renovating very lightly renovating parts of our home like our stairs and we did a few little things underneath the sink and then we had a leak and a lot of the repair people or our friends that are coming in to help us are using safety goggles and they're adjustable and my son likes to wear them and he got like a huge kick out of them so I was just thinking my daughter and my son could wear these and if you guys have sons or daughters that love doing things around the house there's these things there's balances there's measuring tapes and safe things that they could use and put in a really cool toolbox that they have for a dollar, like a black and yellow toolbox, and that would be a really fun gift for like five bucks. Or you can get the toolbox that they have there and then just put all their plastic like um, tools that they might have in the home. This is definitely awesome. It's silly putty and my daughter, my daughter, my um, sister and I always play with this. You can bounce it, you could stretch it, you could snap it, it shows you all in the back. And then I know when I was little, we would um, rub it and put it on top of a newspaper to get the ink on it. And then it would like make a copy of it on the Silly Putty. So this is awesome. This is for four plus. So my son's three and my daughter's five. So this will be perfect for them. And it's perfect for like anybody, any age, loves Silly Putty. And then I got a really cool Disney princess flashlight. And my kids, I don't know if your kids, oh, and it's LED. They're obsessed with going into a dark room and using a flashlight and they have fun for hours. So this is a Disney princess one that has all of the princesses on there. She's gonna love it. And I got my son a boy one. Then I got a My Blocks Fire Department um, cool little construction blocks. They're just like Legos for a dollar. So they get this whole entire kit to make a little helicopter. And my kids love helicopters. They love anything that has to do with fire rescue, ambulance, police. They had a lot of other ones, and I didn't take any pictures, but they have more than this. I think they have like three or four other others. So for a dollar, you can't go wrong. I'm excited for them to use it. Then I got this really fun um, wind-up train set. So if you could see, it's like a little tiny... This is the train track, and there's four of them, and they put them together, and then there's this little Santa Claus train track, and there's a little wind-up thing right here. And it's not battery powered, which I love because I feel like it might work a little bit longer and then I won't have to keep on giving them batteries for it. So I thought it would be cute for them to be playing with for Christmas and all year long because it's definitely something that they're using for their fine motor skills, twisting this up for my three-year-old and putting the train track together. And it's something that a three-year-old can do. So that will be very good. And when he accomplishes it, he will be so proud of himself because we have a big train set here and it's hard and then we have another Thomas the train set and it's super hard to put together so I thought, thought this would be a cute little one for a dollar I mean you can't go wrong I'm almost done with my daughters I've got a six line marker and you can make all those different designs and I thought for a dollar to give them like a bunch of markers they love um, 
using their markers and I thought this would be a creative way to have fun to write their letters or make train tracks or just design something cute. I got a hairbrush for my daughter. She needs a new one so this is a purple one and it's a really big wide one and I usually brush her hair when it's wet so I think this will be the, the trick to work on her hair. This one seems to be really really nice and along with a hairbrush I got her a really cute, oops, a really cute princess mirror and if you could see on the back it's plastic but it's so pretty guys it's like really really pretty and it's beautifully done and it's plastic and she's going to be so obsessed with it like brushing her hair um, thinking she's like a Disney princess so they were using my mirror the other day and they thought it was the coolest thing in the whole entire world so for them to have you know a mirror and a brush that will make my kids happy I don't know about yours but my kids love that stuff um, this is a cool little like fine motor skills um, logic puzzle and it's a really tall it's called tower puzzle and this is for ages six plus so I might have to help her it's 50 pieces and it's five inches and about 19 inches five inches wide and 19 inches high and it's really really pretty I love Beauty and the Beast, so she's going to be surprised with that. And then last but not least, I got them Play-Doh, each a Play-Doh. She has the white one. We have pink and all different colors, but we do not have white. So that's going to be helpful when we're trying to make something that has the color white in it. So let's get started with my son's collection, and I'll share with you guys what he has. So I also got them a two-pack. I'm going to take apart this pack and give one to my daughter that's pink. And then one to my son that's blue. The blue is a bubble gum um, flavor. And then the pink one is a fruit punch. My kids fight over chapstick all the time. And my son asks for me. My son always wants my chapstick. And it's a girl chapstick. So this will be great because it's a boy chapstick. It's blue. And boys can use blue chapsticks. And girls can use pink chapsticks. So for a dollar, I will split this up and they will get oh, both get their own little chapsticks from Finding Dory. Super cute. And like I did with my daughter, I did Play-Doh. I got him black because you never know, you might need black Play-Doh. I never saw this and I thought we needed black so this would be perfect. I also got him the same marker, line markers, and I got him a really cool blue boy brush. It's nice and shiny and blue. And I got him this really awesome... I got him a mirror as well. It's like a green mirror. So it also is neat because it folds up and he could like mess around with the handle. It goes both ways. He can hang it up. So it's a really cool boy mirror that he can have just like his sister, but it's boyish and he'll love it. I also got him chocolate. I got the wind up train. He's gonna love the safety glasses. And then I got him the Avenger flashlight. So this is also LED and it's a pretty good size and it's super cute. I love it. They love flashlights. You can't go wrong with the LED flashlights. And then I got him the same one. Like I said, there's different ones. I got him this uh, Silly Putty. So I got these cute little bolts, um, little kits to put a plane and a bulldozer together. I forgot. I'm going to give my daughter the bulldozer and I'm going to give my son the plane. And on the back it shows you all the bolts that come with it and the tools that come with it. They're like small little tools, but I thought it would be like a really great idea for them to put together with their father during the weekend and it's for eight plus so this is a perfect little stocking stuffer for any of your nieces nephews or grandkids and i'm hoping that they'll be really good and if they accomplish these there's another set at the dollar tree um so i think there's four all together and there's like a race car so these are really really cool for a dollar these are really good for fine motor skills and just doing something with their father and then they could play with it afterwards and last but not least, I got my son a really cute puzzle as well, but it's 24 piece, so it's not as big. Hers is 50 piece, and it's the PJ Mask puzzle. So that is what I got for my kids, and I hope they really enjoy it. I hope you guys like this. Let me know if you guys like it. Give me a thumbs up, and then let me know any really cool things you guys found at your Dollar Tree for your stocking stuffers. I'll see you guys in my next video.